brain tech here, where tech is made simple. Microsoft Edge has received another update, and this latest update was made available on the 2nd of February, which was late yesterday in my region. Now, this is the sixth point release update that has been made available for version 109, which is the latest stable release. And once again, um, we are looking at a two-sided update. Um, it at first is a maintenance update and then also addresses one security issue in the browser. So because we are dealing with a security flaw, it's always good to double check that your browser is up to date. And once this update has been applied, uh, the browser version will be bumped up to 109.0.1518.78 and that point release has been upgraded from 0.70 to 0.78. Now um, at first it is a maintenance update which is um, the sixth maintenance update that Microsoft has rolled out. So obviously since the release of version 109 there have clearly been some issues and maintenance updates are quite common. Microsoft do roll them out between major version upgrades. And then over and above that, we also get one edge specific security fix that has rolled out. Now, this is not a Chromium security fix. This is a edge browser security fix. And um, at this stage, though, the release notes are not telling us what the security update is actually fixing and addressing. But nonetheless, if you have experienced any bugs or performance issues in the browser, and because this is a security update, um, just double check your browser is up to date. Now, with that all out of the way, um, something else I have also noticed that the update does include is the new horizontal edge bar. So if we head back to the menu, head down to more tools, yeah, we'll see launch edge bar. And as we can see, we get the new edge bar layout, which um, has been uh, in testing in the preview channels. And at this stage seems to be on a controlled rollout as I'm not seeing it um, on my Windows 10 device at this stage. On Windows 10, we are still getting the vertical uh, layout for the edge bar, which looks more or less like the news and interests feed. But nonetheless, just letting you know about this, that the new edge bar for your, basically you can use on your desktop as a quick shortcut uh, to search is now available. And I have covered this uh, quite in detail in previous videos when it was still uh, in testing in Edge Canary, which is a preview version of the browser. And just to demonstrate, um, you get some related searches and then you can um, just do a search straight from the convenience of your desktop. So I'm just going to go ABC, any random search, and there you go, you get the idea. So the Edge Bar now, the new horizontal Edge Bar is now available and um, you get the little, uh, little icon for the Edge Bar in your system tray, which you can also quit and open the Edge Bar and you get um, your your profile uh, you can head to other profiles if you have more than one profile in, enabled you can auto launch edge bar which will start when um, your browser starts you get access to rewards about and you can actually close that so just letting you know the new horizontal new edge bar layout is now available on a controlled rollout uh, in the stable version of edge after this point release has rolled out and then um, something else just to take note of, we are currently on Edge version 109. And next week, we are expecting to get Edge version 110, which is the next stable release. And that's going to be made available from the 9th of February 2023, which will start um, possibly rolling out from next week, Thursday, the 9th onwards into the weekend. So Edge version 110. Uh, the next stable release making its way to the stable channel next week. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.